All right, hello everyone, and thank you for joining us here. My name is Christian Martin of Christian Martin & Associates, a sports and technology consultancy firm for and partner of the upcoming Sporting Global Summit. The Sporting Global Summit is a three-part virtual event bringing together the greatest minds in sports to talk about data and the future of the sports industry. And it'll be kicking off on Wednesday, August 26th. Today, I'm joined by one of the event speakers. His name is Dr. Daniel Rasher. Dr. Rasher is president and founder of Sports Economics LLC, partner at OSKR LLC, where he has published research and consulted for hundreds of sports clients, including the NBA, NFL, MLB, NHL, NCAA, and pretty much any of the big players in sports. He received his PhD in economics from UC Berkeley, and he is also the director of academic programs and professor at the University of San Francisco Sport Management Program. Dan, thanks for joining me today. Thanks for having me. Thanks for being here. So um, can you tell us a little more specifically, what do you currently do in the sports industry? Yeah, so I'm a sports economist. Um, and as you said, I teach at the University of San Francisco and I conduct research. Um, I have over 70 publications, including a textbook. But then I also provide consulting to the sports industry in the area of economics and finance and kind of applied business analysis um, to teams, leagues, athletes, sponsors, brands. It really kind of cuts across anything that sort of needs to be measured uh, that, that involves economics or finance. I'm, I'm really there to uh, help out. Awesome. That sounds like a lot of different work you've been up to, so that's cool. Um, can you tell us, what was your first sports job and how did it happen for you? So my first sports job was in 1998. Um, I had just begun teaching and Bill Sutton, who some folks may know, um, he's one of the, the sort of leaders in, in sport management. He asked me to help him do some surveys at the uh, men's final four basketball tournament in San Antonio, Texas, and then take that survey data and analyze it and try to measure the impact that the event was providing on the local community. Um, and I did that and I really liked it. <laughs> and so I kept pushing for more work, um, kind of sending out feelers to people and just sort of grew my consulting business uh, from that point forward. Wow. That's, I mean, that sounds like a great opportunity too in itself. It, it was, I mean, it was really, you know, being there at the right time and, and, and having sort of the right skills to be able to help him. Awesome, thanks for that. And then last question here, what are you gonna be talking about at the Sport in Global Summit? Just give us a little sneak peek, what, what can we expect? Yeah, so I'm gonna be talking about the, the use of data analysis for sound decision-making in sports, but I think what would be most interesting is I'll be going over examples. Of, of you know when I've been asked to come in, okay, look, we have this issue we're trying to figure out, get a bunch of information, how do we analyze it and then how do we use that to sort of change the decision that may have been made without it or give guidance to whoever, you know, whoever the client was. And so I'll be uh, going over some of the examples that I've done in my, in my work. Cool. Well, I'm excited to see what we can learn from you, Dan. So thanks for being here. And I want to remind those who are listening, the Sporting Global Summit is August 26th, and you can find the registration information at sportingglobal.com and also connect with the speakers who have their profiles on the platform. So thanks again, Dan, and we look forward to seeing you at the summit. I'm looking forward to it also. See you All there. Right. See you there. Bye.